Stefano, could you present the outside? Sure. Which... Yes, well, here you find when you come, the first sight is these two windows where I always keep my best treasures of all, especially the novelties, of course, because that's the first things that you have uh, to see when you come. Uh, so you can here see a little brief examples of the, also the new Viscontis, the new Pineda, La Grande Bellezza, with the, this uh, new developed and designed uh, nib by Dante, yeah. flexible nib. I uh, love so much. I think you have some on the counter that we can yeah, take yeah. a better look at it. For sure. Here we have the silver Here dust. Here we have the silver dust of, uh, from, uh, from Visconti. Uh, waiting for some new ones to come in uh, very soon. And uh, here we have uh, Aurora, the new Seeger Blue and uh, the Marta edition. And uh, one of the collections I love the most from, uh, uh, from Aurora. Uh, the Minerali collection, so the demonstrator ones. Yeah, it's this one. It's amazing. I, I always think that uh, it's the most brilliant demonstrator uh, resin uh, that I've ever seen. And, here uh, we can see some deltas. Here you have some deltas. These, these are my own ones, my Fantasia collection. Of course, it's made in celluloid. As I told you before, that's uh, my beloved material. This is some here, Leonardo pens. Here pens. you have some Leonardo pens. Uh, the one is uh, the Abyss Celluloid and some uh, beautiful uh, Momento Zero um, I think it's the resin. The first resin, edition. Yeah, that's the first edition. You see yeah. also some watches from Horis. That's uh, maybe the best well-known brand that I have uh, that I deal in the shop. I love this Swiss brand. It makes amazing watches. Sorry for here, the here for is the, the sub, here is the tram yeah, yeah. Uh, it does nearby uh, this is the Monte Grappa and, and Monte Grappa here I would like to point out especially the new Monte Grappa collection that is the first collection from this uh, lovely Italian brand made uh, uh, with a piston filling system the Roman yeah, piston filling special. system. Uh, with a very visible and fair price, I would rather say. Down there we have down the there, pelicans. Down there it's dedicated to pelicans. So you have uh, many of the good additions from there. Uh, the orange one that I love. Uh, the very famous the uh, ocean swirl. Yeah, that's my favorite one. The, the Renaissance brown. Uh, the new M600 uh, turquoise. Uh, the the, the Stresemann. And uh, we are looking for a very exquisite piece made by Pelican for uh, its uh, 180th anniversary. It's a very special limited edition made in just uh, 180 pieces. That's a very, uh, it's a NEM 1000. Uh, it's a huge fan, big and um, very expensive. And you see some stipulas there too. Yes, and on the left. On the other side, there it's is the, Mont Blanc. That's the Mont Blanc side, and we can see the new the Beatles yeah, edition. The Beatles pen. That's a, it's a very unique, unique pen. That pattern of colors is uh, so, uh, so I exclusive. Uh, so, so you have to like it. It's a huge, it's heavy psychedelic. pen. A psychedelic, yeah, exactly. And then you have the Rouge and Noir collection, uh, the M collection. That's a nice pen uh, for uh, youngsters, I would say. Yeah. And I really uh, enjoy the, the magnetic the feel. Magnetic feel, yeah, exactly. exactly. And moving uh, up, we have the new up, collection, yeah. the Little Prince. The, yeah, the Petite Prince, who is from Mont Blanc. That is uh, a collection that probably is linked to the uh, writer's edition uh, of uh, uh, the past year, dedicated to saint exupéry The writer of the Petite Prince that had a huge success for Mont Blanc. Uh, that probably inspired them to to make this uh, collection and here we have some leather goods and here we from have, them yeah we have uh, backpacks uh, uh, portfolios uh, wallets uh, uh, money clips uh, um, cufflinks uh, key rings uh, um, phone uh, phone, phone covers cases. and whatever you like and even the new collection from Mont Blanc of uh, inks 
because Montblanc has started two years ago to make special limited edition inks uh, linked to each uh, and, and every collection he's doing. Okay, let's step inside. Here is the, on the right side as you enter the shop is the Montblanc. Yeah, the Montblanc uh, shopping shop. Here you have, you can see most of the writer's editions by Montblanc, uh, the one that have not been robbed, uh, I assume. And, uh, also, some of the pieces that were saved from the robbery. Some, and some of the pieces that were saved. Here we have a ink cabinet. Yeah, the yeah the ink cabinet, where uh, there is my lovely colleague uh, Patricia that uh, take care of them. If you want uh, something, uh, that yeah, this suggests in Italian that if you want an ink, you can ask her. <laughs> um, it's so neat. Yeah, because she loves colors. She I used see. to paint. Uh, uh, she's a painter actually, so if you want a, a really good uh, suggestion uh, when you buy an ink, you can, you truly have to ask her. I, I brought her the, the, the present with the coloring, with the, yeah. with the yeah. ink swabbing kit and she, she, she was will, happy like a child. She was happy like a child. Here we have some uh, shirt accessories. Yeah, we have some shirt, some um, pieces of shirt Cuffings. from a wrist that I use uh, to, to show how cufflinks uh, matches with your with your shirt, so you can try it like this. It's very, it's very easy to show that, and uh, it's amazing uh, uh, the impression that could do showing a yeah. good cufflink uh, compared with the with the with the shirt you should use. Yes, and uh, here you have also a little cabinet where uh, I take personally near me. By hand, where I can show all the Pelican Souverain collections, starting from uh, the M four hundred to to the M one thousand, in all the colors possible. And, and uh, I believe that this is the pen that I tested last time and yeah, became in love with it. The M one thousand, the M one thousand, yeah, the Pelican. Here we can see the some of the Mont Blanc notebooks. Yeah, they are available here. Yeah, I really have just this desk to show up, so I usually put on the desk not only Mont Blanc as they would want, as they is the, the rule is that you don't have to put anything that is not Mont Blanc on their desk, but shh, we don't say that, nobody knows that. Here it's the, <laughs> <laughs> the ink from Mont Blanc, the, where you keep the refills, yeah. and the inks and the notebooks. Here we have some leather accessories exactly. and here we have the Kaweco showcase. And I, may I show you something that I really um, oh. uh, am attached to. This is, uh, this is not just a pen. This is something that uh, is the history of my shop because this is uh, the limited edition of the 149 that Montblanc made in uh, the year 2000 when they were celebrating the... The millennium? The, no, the 75th anniversary of the Meisterstück collection, not of the, of the brand, but of the Meisterstück. It was made in rose gold with uh, a little diamond on the top cap and uh, you had uh, the magnificent 149, 149 nib yeah. with the logo of the 75th anniversary and the uh, mother of pearl top cap and uh, here is the good part of this pen my initials on it because uh, the shop uh, was founded in 1924 exactly the year they were celebrating when uh, the Meister Stuck uh, was born the first time so I was uh, uh, when they celebrated it I was invited to come to the celebrations and they, they they give me this pen as a gift to me so I will treasure it for the rest of my life I think that that should be stored away someplace where nobody can can get to it yeah <laughs> that's why it hasn't been robbed <laughs> <laughs> yes so uh, we can uh, see the Graf of Urban Castell yeah Graf and also the Lamy yeah, the section Lamy. Here the, the tower uh, for uh, Kaweco, where you can see uh, the, the German uh, the German pastor, yeah. the German dog. 
he he tried to look after the shop during the night but uh, she didn't he wasn't bark. able no or she didn't he didn't, bark. Bark. he didn't bark no yeah um but he's i i love he's it. been a loyal companion for he's been yours. a loyal companion yeah he practically yeah. stays silent all the time that we recorded yeah, exactly he's very exactly. nice he's reliable on this he's reliable on, <laughs> on keeping quiet yeah so here we have a small part of the visconti of the visconti yes um, I'm uh, looking forward to getting some uh, some some new stuff that is coming out uh, this year from them. Uh, something you can already see there. You have even if it's a ballpoint, you can see the new trims they have added to the uh, Medici uh, collection. The one with the rose gold. The one with the rose gold. Exactly. Yeah. And this is the dark age. If I'm. This is the dark correct. age. The Homo sapiens dark age. Exactly. Here we have a ballpoint from Divina. You have a ballpoint from the, the Divina Elegance Green. And there you see a very unique pen. Uh, the Pininfarina. The Pininfarina, yes, with the retractable tubular nib. Being a, a Visconti collector, I'm, uh, I'm very known to, to recognize almost any model out of it. <laughs> there you can see also the, the, the traveling ink pot, patented by, by Visconti, that it's always a very nice accessory uh, and it's together. coming with the silver dust in the same uh, it came for, uh, with the silver the dust same exactly box. you're right and of course we can see some watches and yeah, some, some pocket watches some yeah some shepherds some conklings and uh, hand watches yeah there you have the mundane uh, the swiss official railways uh, uh, watch and here you have the aurora section here is the, the Aurora section. Yeah, you can see the, the one they dedicated to Rome, the one made for their 8th anniversary. It's the one from the left or from the it's right? It's the one from the left. The left, the, yeah. this one. This one, yeah. this, uh, the sterling silver one with the pattern, with the guilloche pattern on it, engraved. And uh, the section is in uh, um, Bordeaux, acrylic resin. Going down, we have some special collection also from yeah. uh, Aurora. This is the pen made for their 75th anniversary. Which one? The the golden one. The golden one. Yeah. Ah, it's this one. Yeah, this one. And you can see um, behind that uh, the showcase that show you all the passages to make uh, yeah. to make the nib. I can't wait to, to, to see the process. Uh, tomorrow exactly exactly moving down we have a collection moving that down I, you have a, you can see the more recent collections the, a, the from, flex 88 the flex 88 you see the orange there you can see the orange one and the new optima series the flex nib that's the gray one because uh, probably everyone knows that uh, aurora is going to release each month a different color yeah this is something that they often do with every collection of yeah, them. Yeah, yeah. They have learned to do that. <laughs> also we have the I believe if I'm not mistaken the tricolori yeah collection. That's the tricolori collection, yeah exactly. It's uh, the the trees of pen they made for celebrating the Italian flag. Yes and also here we have the Parker here you have showcase. The, exactly the Parker showcase we section. Have the the where big red course, where of course yes the big part of it is dedicated to the dwarf Hall collection especially the new one that i love uh, very much much better than uh, much more than uh, than the previous uh, the versions of this pen um, parker used to make uh, a different version of dwarf Hall, just changing a little features each year uh, so this one i love the most upwards we have upwards. some uh, some stipulas yeah here you have a mixture because i like to to change my windows uh, uh, matching the colors of the items that are inside so the watches are blue or red and then I chose to pick up a few stipulas that I like uh, you have like, some Delta probably. and you have some Delta Capri yes there because uh, the blue was the same and I love that that is something uh, still uh, uh, reminds me of uh, the, the beautiful production of Delta. Today we met the, one of the owners of, of Delta, one, one of the former owners the of former, Delta. Uh, one of the co-founders co of, yes. uh, of Delta, that is uh, the, uh, the lovely father of, the father of Salvatore. Salvatore. 
here we have the the sailor here you have the sailor you can see the the cosmos and the the pilot i and like pilot. i like to uh, take uh, the japanese world all together and so you have a, a lovely collection also of the Hiroshizu inks. Yeah, maybe yeah, yeah. maybe the most famous ink in, in in the world. Also, moving upwards, we can see some lighters yeah, from Dupont. Yeah, the one that the, were saved because um, actually a lot of them got a lot of them stolen. were robbed. And uh, here you see some other deltas still uh, still remaining. So this is the uh, rediscover Pompeii made in a celluloid. This is celluloid. Which one? This one. This one, this yellowish green uh, color celluloid, uh, that was uh, I I love that. Even if maybe he didn't got that much success, that it was uh, uh, I I think it was worth. Um, and uh, that is a special collection that was made for uh, the the first one that you see, the big one uh, on on the on the front in the center. It uh, a special pen that was made for the Italian pen forum. Yeah by Delta okay we have here Carandash Carandash yeah it's the Swiss uh, manufacturer the, the Swiss manufacturer they make lovely pens uh, and lovely they, inks lo and lovely inks they are mostly made out of uh, lacquer or wood and they are a gorgeous pen very expensive like any Swiss, Swiss. item yeah <laughs> And uh, then uh, go in the go in here. You can uh, see the Monte Grappa. Monte Grappa. Yeah, that's that's the uh, National Reflex. One of one of my favorite brands, I must say, together with uh, all the other Italians. And uh, here you see some uh, a piece of art. And then you see a limited edition collection, and you see uh, a pen made for writing. So the three souls, I would say, of Monte Grappa, the Canova, it's made of real uh, marble. Marble. Yeah. Yeah. Gorgeous. It's uh, it's uh, a, a paste of marble uh, crunched together and then to create uh, and then engraved and uh, made out of of, of real uh, real marble. And, and uh, the brown it's one? amazing. And the brown one, it, it's an old limited edition. Uh, by Monte Grappa, it was dedicated to Antonio Stradivari, uh, oh, the, 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 the famous violin maker. Uh, the famous violin maker, yeah. Maker, yeah. Yeah. In fact, the the, the, the body of the pen is made in an acrylic resin that resembled the wood uh, from which he, he cut uh, and uh, shaped uh, his violin. And on the left, and on here? the left, you have uh, the 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 national flag. Ah, you know, you meant no, that, that little one. The little one is called Dielmo. It that's an old collection by Monte Grappa too. Uh, it was called Dielmo because, because Elmo was uh, the original name of the factory during the war, uh, where they used to make uh, specially nibs. Uh, there were a factory of nibs. Upwards we have the National Flex. Yeah, course, the new yeah, one. The new one. The new color. The new celluloid co color called caramel. Caramel. Yeah. Uh, and uh, the. Um, the color exactly matches uh, the name that inspired the collection. And, and here the is on, amazing. Uh, that name is amazing. on the right we have uh, a ballpoint, 1930. No, that that, that was a called a classic collection uh, from Monte Grappa. It's the pen belonging to the 90s, actually, and then uh, was made out of uh, celluloid, a dark grey black celluloid. And uh, with sterling silver trims, that's uh, one of the the best production of uh, Monte Grappa. That's depend for what they have. Uh, uh, he has earned rewards from every part of the world. I think we should uh, show the those special uh, pens that you prepared. Yeah, let let's see some uh, some good pieces. Yeah, I've already shown you my special. Uh, Meister's to 149 edition. That is not for sale. Actually, it's for sale, but not the one with my initials on it. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> I have kept uh, uh, an another piece, another special piece. But I wanted to show this one because, from my point of view, that's where it all started. Who, who doesn't know this? Oh. 
This is the the this the is most, probably the most famous. Uh, this is the first limited writer edition. edition. This is not just the first writer edition. This is uh, the the limited edition. The English would say. Uh, because this is where it all started, because uh, probably the, the most uh, the important role that Montblanc had in our uh, passion is to create for the first time a limited edition. Montblanc founders and people on the, on the marketing side were the brilliant people who thought that a, a pen could be a so collector's item. Edition. And this, yeah. With this pen they started all and all the other brands follow them on this uh, on this journey on this journey yeah I understand now the writer's edition of my have completely changed in uh, in the materials in the shape in the taste but because it's uh, it's the most uh, old collection of pens so probably it depends on the fact that uh, it uh, ranges all uh, 20 years uh, more yeah, than 20 fine. years so if you collect it it's amazing because you can see from the start how the taste during this evolved. last uh, evolved yeah exactly. and this is for sale this is for sale yeah not this one because this one is mine but i have another one <laughs> yeah people should uh, should go to the website or find the email of yours yeah and, he has and to find the email because i'm not so keen on putting up everything on the on the on the website so you have to ask me I know I know sometimes it's not uh, so easy to do it but just send me an what email. else can we see ah, let's see uh, another pen that I love that's uh, my Fantasia collection the Fantasia Corsani that's it's a pen in celluloid of course and uh, I've made uh, this collection just before Delta closed fortunately this time and uh, the pen is made out in six colors of celluloid each one is limited to 25 pieces the box is this one and this is the lovely green malachite one it's a very gorgeous pen the work is exquisite especially the color of the ebonite of course here you have a compromise because i wanted to share with uh, all my customers the love for uh, this historic material so i wanted it to be uh, affordable so this pen fits uh, uh, an amazingly performant uh, um, uh, harmonic steel nib in different sizes and you have a, a cartridge converter system even if you can uh, um, uh, allow to 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 use the the piston just unscrewing the the bottom the uh, converter you can is, screw you can uh, yeah this is the uh, more fancy version of of the of the cartridge converter yeah that's the fancy version you're right yes what more can we see here i wanted to share something even also something new not something that already probably you know that about this is uh, what uh, we have just seen me and you this yeah. morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, at, going, at, uh, going to Leonardo. going to visit uh, the Leonardo Officina Italiana factory. It's a very limited edition. This is a piece. very limited edition. This is uh, uh, an acrylic resin made out of uh, four different barrels. Uh, attached and glued together to create this, this lovely composition of, of different materials this glued together ex exactly uh, and uh, I loved this uh, resin uh, Salvadore had so few pieces of this so I told him yeah you have to do a very little collection for me this is so just 15 pieces I tried to I tried to take one of these pens today with me and he told me it is so limited he could not uh, give anything to me yeah and 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 i was present so he couldn't do, couldn't do that <laughs> yeah <laughs> we have some uh, special pieces from aurora we have some special pieces from aurora yes um, this is the new optima flex we were talking about especially because uh, we have talked about flexible nibs and here we have probably one of the, the best examples in the in the past years in the recent years and this is the new with the rhodium trims the new flexible 
from uh, I think this, this from this is collection matching perfectly to my 88 so consider this yeah to to this is the green one of course as you can see and um, I must say that they have surely improved the performance on the nib from uh, the, the previous collection it's, uh, it's I, quite I'm owning a, a 88 and in comparison to this one that I tried last time I've seen the f the, the first color mm -hmm. that was released it is so much improved and a little bit softer and more easier to, to, to yeah. flex than the 88 yeah. version yeah, that's true. And let's close it and uh, let me show you another another brighter edition from Mont Blanc, a very well known one, the Agatha Christie collection. But this is one of the most sought after pens in the market because it's the one made of just 4810 pieces. So it's uh, the, the most rare of it. It, because it has uh, golden trims and not the classic sterling silver trims and uh, the eyes of, uh, of the snake are uh, made out of a blue exquisite sapphires let me get that close and you have the famous snake on the nape too yes Is this for sale? This is for sale, yeah, yeah. Also by email? Also by email, yeah, you won't find on the website, you have to call me. <laughs> I prefer to deal personally with each and every one of you, if you're keen to buy a, a, a pen like this. Okay, I think that this is it, Stefano. I would like to thank you very much for this opportunity and I, I will leave a your website link and also the Facebook page link and every detail into the description of this video thank you for being with us thank you for everything and Stefano if you want it to has say something. It, has been, it has been a pleasure I have to thank you for your friendship and uh, your lovely uh, company that you made with me and she did with me today and uh, the next days I'm looking forward to them, uh, to being with you and um, I wish you all uh, a good and lovely riding week. Thank you everyone and see you soon. See you soon. Bye. Bye.